This is the Chang'an CS85. It's the most affordable SUV coupe on the market. And today we're gonna find out if it is worth its 131,000 dirham price tag. Before we go any further, I just wanna say that there's a lot of cool tech on this car that you are going to want to wait around for. So here's a sneak peek of what you can expect. Now, I've driven a fair number of Chinese cars in the past few years. Everything from Cherry to GAC and Haval to Honchi and everything in between. But right off the bat, I can tell you that this Chang'an is very different. Not only does it look good and have plenty of features, but it's also very nice to drive. Power is provided by a 2-litre turbocharged engine that puts out 233 horsepower and 360 newton meters of torque. And for those of you wondering, yes, those are extremely impressive numbers because this thing makes more horsepower and torque than a Volkswagen Golf GTI. Impressed? Well, there's more. The 8-speed automatic transmission that pushes power to the front wheels is built by Isin, a company that builds gearboxes for premium brands such as Lexus, Lotus and Porsche, amongst many, many others. And let's just say, this car is a lot faster than you'd expect it to be. Chang'an really hasn't held back on any part of this car. And that is why even the wipers aren't from just any manufacturer. They are from Bosch. The brakes use ventilated discs in the front for better braking performance. And the McPherson strut suspension is tuned beautifully to absorb bumps in the road. But now, let's move on to some of its party tricks. The things that you can tell your friends about. First up is the adaptive cruise control system. It works beautifully, accelerating and braking very smoothly, but by far the best part is how aware it is of its surroundings, showing you all the cars around you and the distance from them on the digital screen in front of you. It's quite similar to the system used by Tesla, really. Its next party trick are its parking skills. And this is really threefold because it's got 360 degree cameras that let you look at your surroundings in virtual reality. It's got automated parallel and perpendicular parking where you don't even need to hold the steering wheel. And then it has something that I'm going to need to get out of the car from. So just let me pull over and show you what makes the CS85 so very special. Believe it or not, but you can park the Chang'an CS85 or bring it out of a parking space without actually being in it. That's right, just like a James Bond movie, you can control this car from the key fob. Let me show you. So you double tap the lock button, use the key for the remote engine starter. Once the car is started, you hold on to the steering wheel button. And once the indicators flash, it's ready for use. Let's bring the car out. It's almost like walking your dog, except you're walking your car. And then you can put it into reverse and send it back into the parking space. Now, the next time someone parks really close to you in the mall, you won't need to jump in through the passenger door or through the boot because Chang'an's already thought of a solution. When it comes to the interior, many believe that Chinese cars are flimsy and that they aren't built well, but that definitely is not the case here. The red and black color scheme complements the dark exterior wonderfully and everything feels solid. The speaker housings are metal, nothing shakes or rattles. And if I were to cover the badges, it could easily pass off as a modern day Hyundai. The leather seats are extremely comfortable they offer heating and cooling, as well as 8-way power adjustment for the driver and 4-way power adjustment for the passenger. There's also a dual-zone climate control system, meaning the driver and passenger can set different temperatures for the AC system, and a 12.3-inch touch infotainment screen that takes center stage on the dashboard. Space in the back is much better than one would expect from an SUV coupe, with plenty of headroom and legroom, even for taller adults. 
Although there aren't any screens to keep the little ones entertained, there are two AC vents, two USB charging outlets and two cup holders as well. In terms of features, it has nearly every feature imaginable from a big sunroof to an ambient lighting system and push button start to a eight speaker sound system. For the techies, there's also mirror link, which lets you connect your phone to the 12.3 inch touch infotainment screen, as well as a camera that lets you record your drive onto an SD card. Think of something like an inbuilt dash cam. Now that's pretty cool. In terms of safety features, there's adaptive cruise control and 360 degree cameras as mentioned earlier, but there's also forward collision avoidance, autonomous braking that kicks in if you don't respond in time, lane departure alert and blind spot monitoring. Now I know you're all thinking it, so I'm just gonna say it. Yes, the Chang'an CS85 does look a lot like a BMW X4, but that's only from certain angles. In the front, it's got a very unique design with plenty of chrome on the bumper and grille, flanked by a pair of full automatic LED headlights, LED daytime running lights, and LED fog lights. For those of you who don't quite fancy the black exterior, you could also have it in red, purple, blue, or gray. And speaking of customization options, our test car is fitted with 19-inch alloy wheels that have been painted black. There are a lot of sharp lines and creases along the bodywork that make it look broad and muscular, especially towards the back, where you can find a pair of wraparound LED tail lamps and four functioning chrome exhaust pipes. When it comes to televisions, Chinese companies like Hisense and TCL have made a solid impact in the market. When it comes to laptops, Chinese companies like Lenovo and Xiaomi have made a solid impact in the market. When it comes to mobile phones, Chinese companies like Huawei and OnePlus have made a solid impact in the market. What I am getting at is that the Chinese have built a solid reputation for themselves in many industries. And if they continue building cars as great as the Chang'an CS85, then we will be hearing a lot more of them in the automotive industry as well. At just 131,000 dirhams, the Chang'an CS85 is a real wake-up call to the Japanese and Korean automakers who seem to be ruling the market, because in a few years, the tables are about to turn. Thanks for watching.